Yep, it is quite literally lit down here. It's lit. It's also lit because I'm watching Sherry's. Oh, and I also wanted to talk about the fact that I changed the name of the vlog again for Vlogmas. And so since I changed it to Zen Like Vlog Holidays, I was like, well, I already call it Zen Like Vlogs, why don't I just call it Zen Like Vlog a Days? And I was sort of inspired by Sharice because she calls her um her vlogmas happy vlog it is and i was like i love that and i obviously don't want to like identically copy her so i have zen life and that's already my thing and it's already zl v anyway so zen life vlog it is i thought it was so cool hopefully she doesn't like hate me for like being inspired by her name and kind of like adding it to mine i thought it was cool but yeah i'm sure she did i don't even know if she watches my vlogs but that's that Hey guys, so I am setting up to film a video right now. I'm using my mom's camera, so hopefully um, it looks nice. Uh, I've never used it before, but it already looks better than mine. Hey guys, this is Maya, and I'm back for another video. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and wash my hair, and then I'm going to come back from the video. And after that, I need to get ready for my for my um, interview at 4, and it's at 4.30 actually. So yeah, um, yeah, I'm excited. My camera, this camera is dead, and oh man, this camera's like so much nicer than mine. So I just finished filming the first part of um, the new video that's going to go up sometime this week and it's a hair video so I think I already told you guys that and I'm just doing the deep conditioning part and yeah then I'm gonna go do some other stuff I'm not gonna tell you everything because you have to watch the video but um yeah so I need to get ready for my uh interview yeah, so I just found that part. I watched a bunch of snaps from Organic Olivia, and I'm pretty sure I've talked to you guys about Organic Olivia before. I love her. She's amazing. She's just so knowledgeable and dedicated to her craft and finding more about health, and she's just so smart and nice and sweet, and she, like, responds to all of her snaps, which I'm sure she gets tons of them, and they're all super genuine and authentic, and it's just like, ugh so great and so nice and like how could she be any better um and she's so beautiful that's the other thing she's really pretty and nice and smart it's amazing that i had an inspiration from cassie cloudy apples uh, i was inspired by one of her videos i think it was like something blue something blue flower or something like that and i really liked how it incorporated poetry and just really cool editing and filming um and i really liked that because although it had really not a lot to do with her channel it was about her which is what her channel is about so i think that was so cool and awesome and different and i have ideas some for stuff similar to that but not the same but definitely some inspiration taken from that um and i always want to like attribute like things that i get my inspiration from and not act like all the ideas that come up on my own, but I feel like that's important in terms of like artistry and like making sure that you credit people that you get inspiration from because there's no nothing wrong with that. Like, I'm, you know, people, artists always take and give from artists and all kinds of things. So I think it's admirable and important to do that. So I have a couple of different things that I really want to do. Some of the things I might not even post depending on what the people who I film with um, decide what they want to do. And that's the other thing. I'm going to be feeling with a lot more people, um, I feel like, in the future. And, I don't know, I just have a lot of really cool ideas. Different things, more creative, editorial, things that really, like, take mind power creativity and not, like, just showing you guys things that I like. Um, 
yeah, I want to be more creative, more interesting, more innovative in my videos. And it's I'm getting more excited, back excited into my main channel again because I got really like stagnant and bored because you were, I was doing the same things over and over and over again. And, like that's not fun, you know. So I want to keep it fun for you guys and fun for myself because that's why I started the channel for myself, not for anything else, not for views, not for subscriptions, not for sponsors or whatever. It's, it was to make cool and to document things. So. That's what I'm going to do. Hey everyone! So I just finished my oh dang it! So I messed up the internet because I didn't realize that one of these light switches over here was like an energy switch. So I messed up the internet. Gotta wait for it to turn back on. So I just finished my um interview. And I feel like it went well. I'm feeling confident. I'm feeling like I answered the questions well. I talked about myself well. I presented myself in a good light. And I hope that I get this internship. I am dying to get it. And I have been wanting to work for this company for a long time now. And I feel like I hope they understood that i feel like i didn't even i feel like i could have been i don't know i don't know i don't want to go back and like dwell on the past but obviously you feel like you'd always do better um but i feel like i did well and i feel like i did well enough to secure my spot and i think i got it so hopefully i'm right <laughs> And I am going to get that email and it's going to say, you got this internship, Maya. <laughs> so yummy. <laughs> I gotta go down and get my hard drive. I really want to make... A sweet potato pie, but I'm gonna make it gluten free, of course, because I was really tempted today, guys, because I'm hungry and there's some challah bread in the kitchen. And challah bread is my favorite bread in the world, it's like the most, the earliest memory of bread that I have is challah. I went to a Jewish preschool, so I ate a lot of challah in my time, and it's like so good it's such a good bread like it's just sweet and soft and delicious and it's amazing but i can't eat it because it's not gluten free and i don't want my eczema to break out and i don't want to be bloated and feel poopy so i refrained but i do want to make the sweet potato pie but i have to make a gluten free crust if i'm going to do that so i have to figure out how to make a gluten free crust oh what the heck am i doing i don't know yeah, so I'm gonna sit down. Oh my god, I need to work out. I'm so out of shape. Hey guys, so I don't know if I talked to you guys earlier about um, Organic Olivia. Oh, I thought that was the camera. But, oh, open. Oh my god. So I'm just gonna have to. Wow, that was really difficult. Yeah, I don't know if I talked to you guys earlier about Organic Olivia, but I love that girl. She's amazing. I don't know her personally, but I've been following her. Oh, sheesh. It's like spilling at the bottom. I'm gonna have to fix that. Um, I've been following her blog and her Snapchat and all of her stuff for a while now. She makes these amazing parasite cleanses, amazing jewelry, um, which I actually ordered one of her pieces um, over the like Cyber Monday holiday sale. And I'm actually gonna be giving it away to you guys. I was at first gonna keep it for myself, but I decided to give it away because she makes amazing pieces and I feel like I've already been touched so much by her her knowledge, her wisdom, her love, and I wanted to share it with you guys. So once I get that in, hopefully it gets in before, I don't know, hopefully it gets in soon. I don't know when she's gonna be sending it out. 
but um if it doesn't get in by the time I want it to I'm gonna keep that one for myself and I'm going to order another one for you guys for the giveaway that I'm doing on my main channel I haven't talked about it so far but I um I'm doing a giveaway for my 3,000 subscribers on my main channel. I hit 3,000 a couple of months ago, I think, and like a month or two ago. And I really wanted to thank you guys for that because um, you guys are amazing. You've been supporting my channel for so long, and I really wanted to repay you. And every time I hit a milestone, I always do... A giveaway on my channel so um, of course I'm doing one for 3,000 and um, I got I ordered that necklace an order protection necklace from Olivia but that's not what I wanted to talk about I wanted to talk about how amazing and smart and incredible and amazing she is mmm Richie get out of there um, so today on Snapchat, if you don't follow her on Snapchat or me on Snapchat, you definitely should. I'm going to put both of our handles down there. She was talking about lymphatic, the lymphatic system, sacral stagnation, and your sh sacral chakra. And it was just so powerful and amazing. And it spoke to me so much. Um, I had to talk to her on there and she's so sweet and she always responds to people's snaps. And she's just such a sweet honest authentic person and you can really feel it in her videos and her snaps and her blog posts that she's really passionate and she really loves what she's talking about and she really truly believes and believes everything she's saying and she really wants everybody to be healed which is amazing and yeah so i i watched her video on snapchat and then i just watched it again on youtube youtube because she uploaded it and it was just so powerful and i was just like wow like i haven't been on the super healthy road as I have been in the past. And I just been inspired to kind of like start my life over, not start my life over, but like reset and reboot and just clear out a lot of emotional, physical, mental and spiritual blockage that I've been having for years, honestly, probably my whole life. But things that I've known about more recently that I've been conscious of and kind of have been avoiding because it's just a lot of things to work through. It's a lot of work. It's, it's a lot of work to try to be your best self. It's not easy and it's hard to give your all and be passionate, be creative, be innovative, be honest. And it's difficult. It's like, a lot, it's a lot of work. So it's so beautiful to see somebody like Olivia who's, who's down to earth, who is realistic and but also so true and everything that she says and everything that she believes in. It's just like so refreshing to see. And I just enjoy her so, so much. I wish we could be best friends and that she didn't live in New York and that I didn't live in Chicago so that we could be best friends because I feel like we would be such good friends. Like she, I've always wanted a friend like her, somebody who is interested in these things that knows more than I do, that can inform me, we can bounce ideas off of each other, like that can be like a support system. I've always wanted a friend like that. Um, and obviously I have Ollie, but like, you know, a friend that's not my boyfriend. But yeah, so anyway, she's a wonderful person. You guys should follow her YouTube channel, her blog, her Snapchat, her Instagram, everything. They're all so good and just wonderful. She's amazing. And I just, even though I don't know her, I just really love her as a person. And yeah, so anyway, also, I think I told you about the interview. It went really well. I hopefully I hear back. From them on wednesday or thursday i'm praying that i got it i feel like i did really well and i feel like i could have done better obviously but i think i did well and i think they enjoyed me and i think they feel like i'll be a good fit so hopefully that works out but also um i'm working on you know just being okay with what happened because what happened is what happened and how i was how I performed is how I performed and there's no other way I could have done it. You know, there's no other way I could have done it because it's already happened. Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling about that. I'm going to drink my juice because I'm trying to kind of just like, you know, calm my my body and my, my organs and my system. It's very frothy because it was in there for a while, but um, watching or, um, 
Roughly Organic, Philly Rock Christina, love her too. And, oh gosh, oh my God. And I'm not gonna knock over my juice, so yeah.